stuff, you know, where people go, oh, it's going to be okay. And you're like, no, you know, it's not. Not when you're feeling that, you know. Mark Ruffalo, who you sat with at the Oscar luncheon, we had a great conversation. And he said, because I think there's this interesting juxtaposition. Your message in the song is important and serious. Yeah, it was like two people. Maybe they put us together like that. You well, know? And, and, and then there's all this frivolity surrounding all these celebrations. And he said, I thought the most interesting thing, he said he didn't mind because all of this brings attention to the artistic efforts and it shows that through your art, you can still do good. Isn't that a great I thing? Think, Isn't that a, I mean, how? what's better than that? Here is Lady Gaga singing, singing the song uh, for the Producers Guild. Amazing performance. Tell it happens to you. All right, your phrase, there that night, she... Oh my God, she brought the house down. It's what Gaga does, which what she just did at the Super Bowl. But like the intimate setting, you know, when she sang just, you know, intimately at the piano, you know, she just blew everybody away. I mean, everybody was like, you know, it's a cynical room, right? And they just were like, you know, <laughs> just floored. When this, when this song is performed Oscar night, is, is, is the performance of the song a win to a degree? Do you yeah. know? Yeah, no, it's amazing. I mean, this, this song has got so far, you know, I mean, it's, it's amazing. It's, it's actually changing things. To be a part of, of this is just, it's so humbling. I'm so honored and, and it's going to be great. And, you know, and if, and, and if it wins, you know what I'll be? I won't be an EGOT. I'll be an OG. Okay. Oscar Grammy. Yeah. OG is perfectly good. Let me ask you this. Grammy, do you, when you walk in the Grammys versus walking to the Oscars, do you know, I don't know why I think this, do you know more people at the Grammys? I know a lot more people at the Grammys because I mean, I'm in the music business, you know, but I'm, I'm starting to know, you know, people in the, in the movie world as I've been doing this a long time, but definitely my world is, is the music business. Yeah. Diane rocking the LA gear. If the gold looked better on her. Uh, so I, like you, I hope they're not leather. I don't want leather. No, yeah, I, they're not leather. no, I think it's leather or something. I hope so. And they have, yeah, that's some other cool ones. Speaking of other, free. <laughs> people love free stuff to that end. Why explain to us as we look at the stuff that you're about to win, folks at home, why do somebody like you, Diane, I'll be honest with you, you can afford to buy this. Why could you like free stuff? Because it feels cool to get it for free. <laughs> I don't know. Is that really bad to say? No, it's, it's honest. There's free donuts. I don't need those. Even if they're free, I don't, I don't really need them. That won't stop me from eating them. I don't know. What else is here? Uh, lots of stuff to look at there. Let, I tell you what, folks at home, uh, you can win this gift bag. We're going to send it to you. Uh, it's our text to win. Five, for Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day. Uh, 515151 uh, to ALT. Text the word ALT, ALT, to 515151. Oh, our flowers just fell. Not to worry. Uh, and if you're the appropriate texter, you will get that gift bag. Diane Warren, we hope that you get, um, on Monday, a Grammy. And then in less than two weeks, the Oscars will see you on the red carpet there. Thank you. Thank you. Good to talk. We'll go back to you guys. All right, Sam. Thanks for that. Still ahead, Mexico 